Welcome back to Seen It Before, where we have a new little series coming at you guys right now. It's actually not a series. I'm going to say this is a uh, breakdown of the newest Stranger Things trailer that just dropped today. So let's let's just get right into this because there's a lot to talk about with this. Yeah. You have lost. So that was the Stranger Things trailer um, right off the bat um, for season four. Um, I noticed that there's a talking villain. Um, yeah. He starts talking. It's like you, like whatever you said so he, will come to I, an I end. wrote down what he wrote. He said in the very beginning. Okay. You've broken everything. Your suffering is almost at an end. Okay. So who, who is he talking to? Is he talking to, he's probably talking to either 11. Probably 11. Or maybe like surprise comeback. I'm um, talking to Billy. Who might who might not be dead? Billy didn't really break anything, though. I I think it could just be a like a line for the trailer too. Okay. But that person that's talking, we know Robert Englund got cast in this season. Is yeah. he? Is he? Is was, that his voice? Okay. Like, so one is he the old? Is he the old man that's blind? Yep. Uh, is that him or is it like with like the, he got the cuts yeah, oh, on I his saw. eyes? Oh, I, I know what you're talking about. Um, I wonder if that's him. Or if, or, or if he's the big bad, or if he's this villain, that mysterious villain that we have no idea who he is. I've never, I've never, is this the master of the multi, or the, the multi, uh, master of the upside down? I don't um, know. But there's still one more season after this season. So there's going to be a lot in this season. Wait, there's season, season they're doing five, season five? Season five is ending it. Yes. What? You didn't know. Oh my were, God. Yeah. I had no idea. Yeah, oh my God. This is breaking news, everybody. This <laughs> to is you, season to five. You. Yeah. Breaking <laughs> news. Um, but yeah, so. Going back to the trailer, um, it's either Robert Englund or it's Eleven's father, Dr. Brenner. I think it could be very well be him. I forgot what happened to him in season one. Did he get pulled into the Upside Down as, he, he as to be died. defeated? I or he, he just got killed. He just got killed by a Demogorgon? I think so. I okay. don't remember, though. Yeah, so I don't, I don't, <laughs> I don't really know. Uh, what I want to know is what is the ticking grandfather clock? What's that whole See, thing that's about? That's a lot. It's in a lot of the promotional material. And I'm, yeah. Is that just a symbol of like time is like getting the to- the clock is ticking and stuff like that? Yes, but it's, it's, it's an old all, creepy. But it's in that creepy house, yeah, that creepy house has been teased a lot too. So it's got to have something with time. And there, in one of the trailers they showed before, which you haven't seen, because this is the first trailer you've seen for. Yeah, I've, I've done four. a I've done an okay job at kind of keeping this secret for myself, but you know. yeah, in one of the other trailers they show this house and then there's this family. Mm-hmm. beforehand so there's going to be some past stuff coming up with this house i have no idea what it's going to be yeah but it looks like something something happened there and it's going to be interesting to see what they do with that then we see uh billy's grave and everything and oh yeah the dear and, billy, dear billy. That, that's, that's only of, an episode too yeah. so hmm interesting i'm excited <laughs> um, yeah but um what i noticed in the trailer was that they were playing separate ways Dude, I, I, when I, I I didn't notice it at first, but when they set, then it started going. I'm like, I'm like, dee, 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 dee. I'm like I've heard this, I've heard that like it's, those, you know, those uh, notes before. It's my favorite Journey song. Yeah, really? I love separate. Ways. I live in a, or no, why not? Uh, what's the other one? Don't stop believing. Don't stop. That's the. One. <laughs> what? I always said living on a prayer. Bro, your dad is gonna be so mad at you right now. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, <God. laughs> <laughs> You're dead to me. <laughs> um, but yeah, this season's going to be so emotional. And just from the trailer itself, like from Billy's grave to, you know, Eleven and Will living in California. And I'm, then we find out Hopper's still alive. When they find that out, like Hopper's still going to be alive, that's going to be very emotional. Yeah. But what's his role? What's his role in this season? He's I mean, in I don't Russia even, somewhere. I don't even think he knows because he's just like, I think I'm he brought here for another purpose or something like that. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. So are, do they think that he has the powers or something? Because they put like a gas mask on him and like they were trying to like basically like kind of doing like experiments on him like they were doing to Eleven. So it's like, are they, yeah. what are they trying to do? You know, I wonder. I, I, I don't know. Is he like in a different universe? Is he like in the same, is yeah, he just in Russia? Is that's he in a actually, timeline? Like, well, yeah, we don't know if he's in a, if he's in the same universe. They could, yeah. yeah they could pull they, Because shit. we don't see him with any of the other characters. I don't think they would go that outlandish. They already have the upside down. That's already one the other. The upside dimension, down could be so. a different universe by itself too. Right, but it has a very distinct look to it. It's yes, not. It it's not like it's a Russian prison, you know. Speaking <laughs> of the upside down, it looks like they're all going to end up in the upside down. In yep. this season. Yeah, because well, they, they, it looks like a plan because Nancy says to Steve, "The he's like, I'll see you on the other side." And they, yeah, the other side, and they pull like this like toilet paper yeah, looking thing. Uh, I don't know what that is. Know. 
but <laughs> it looked it looked interesting and like the um, ri- did we see their bikes riding through that or something too? Or yeah, something all the like kids that? are riding their bikes and you're kind of going huh. through you know classic kind of like E. T. ish. Well, yeah, you know, this show because the like, show's Goonies meets inspired e. by all eighty young young eighties kids movies. Dude, it's so. the Goonies meets E. T. Let's just yeah. let's be it's real. Gr- it's great, man. It's I love this style. I love this whole the combination that they were able to do with everything, make it horror. I yeah. wonder if this is going to be a split season like they do in The Walking Dead. They're going to split, like, say... Like different arcs? Two different, different arcs? arcs in the seasons. Because like, it's two parts. So, yeah. like, part one comes out at the uh, end of May, and then the other part comes out in the beginning of July. So one part could be, you know, David Harbour... Or Hopper. <laughs> Hopper <laughs> and, uh, like, say, Eleven and Will. And then the other part could be the, the rest of the gang just by themselves figuring something out. I... And then the, would not like that. Yeah, I, <laughs> I, I like to see wouldn't. everyone in the same, you know, have maybe I don't even like it. Like it's walking dead really pissed me off when they did that going from like one, one group of characters in one episode. That's like, what I mean. Gonna, yeah, I, hate that's that. what I, was thinking. I hate that. I want to see different scenes. I want to see everyone's story progress at the same time. But It would make sense though. If they kind of split it up, it would because Hopper's probably doing nothing in, in the Russian prison for yeah. a while. Or and he's then, just trying to figure out the mystery of why he's there and where he is. Yeah. Well, so. cause last time he got, he just gets blown up in the, in that, reactor room or whatever yeah so he got <laughs> he got that messed looked, up that looked messed up yeah. like we all thought he was dead until like we see that that prom- promo they had like what two years ago now a year and a half two years ago like oh he's alive yeah that came out right after the season three yeah, finale like, oh like yeah. that's the last material we saw until that first trailer dropped maybe six months ago or something like that yeah one thing i want to highlight in this is that um i love it when they have different styles, like hairstyles and like different clothing styles for all the characters as we progress. I love that. Eleven looks like Winona Ryder. Yeah. She looks just I like I think her. she's going for that look yeah. or whatever, but I, um, I like Hopper's new look with the shaved head. I like um, – Max isn't really different, uh, but Ke- – uh, what's his name? Caleb. Caleb, um, yeah. I don't, well, that, well, that's his acronym, but like what's his – I forgot. Uh, oh, oh, Lucas. Lucas. Yeah. Yeah. Lucas has like the the uh, flat top. He's um. They can't give Will a not stupid uh, hairstyle. He looked like a stupid bowl cut again. Look, get stop it. You know it, it looks awful on him. Yeah. No. And then Mike has just like long black hair. But so they look older. They change their styles with the. So this I like. It's only supposed to be six months later. Though. That's the problem. They look so much older. Yeah. They, already. They, they really do. Like, that's the I? problem with this. I'm just like, oh. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. It's like it. It really feels like a new season, a new part to this show. So I like. That's what I like about it. Very excited to see where they go with it. I'm very excited to see what Robert Englund's role is because yeah, that's yeah. so cool, man. And speaking of like people, you know, new uh, Paul Reiser's back. You yeah. know, is the Doctor? Yeah. So Dr. Brenner. Yeah. No, that's not Brenner. Brenner's Matthew Modine. You're right. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I got you there. But got uh, me. Paul Reiser, he was the guy that was trying to help them in, at the end of season two, I believe. Yes. Or he yes. was one of the doctors or whatever. I, I know who you're talking about. Yeah, yeah. but, you know, and when Sean Astin passed away. <laughs> or what's his name? We need a moment. We need. All right. <laughs> I'm still there. You're st- you're still need- <laughs> you still need a moment? Okay. <laughs> anyway. I, what's, who's that one guy? I think he's the guitar player. What was um, that about? Yeah, I can that? see them being kind of like a moment where like, he's like, hey, well, I'll distract them by playing guitar or something. It's kind of like no, really 80s. I think that's but- just a trailer thing. I, if they turn it into like, kind of like a Mad Max kind of thing where like, I mean, I don't know. I, I did not like that in Mad Max, but if they do that, if I can see them being like, you know, like let's lure away the monsters or something like that. But well, this, I'm interested who he is as a character. Monster. No, let's talk about this monster for a minute. What the hell is it? Like it's, I think we he's saw like, a Demogorgon in the trailer. Yeah. But like, is that, well, so we, thing. we've seen the Demogorgon. We've seen the Thessal Hydra. Yes. Um, Something like that. We've seen know. the demodogs. We we now we have these bat d- demogorgons that were flying in the. In the I don't upside know if those down. are just regular bats. They're just bats. Okay. I don't know if they were regular bats. But they could I mean, I, I saw them in the upside down, so I figured it was like some sort of new monster yeah, or whatever. Fair, but fair. um, and then we have this whatever he is. He's he's ta- he talks, which is you know, we've never seen that in a Stranger Things yeah, thing it's, before. It's intelligent life. Yeah. So it's like he. It's like a because we we got the idea that the Thessal Hydra was was the main villain trying to control will through from the other side in season two and then the thessal hydra came back as and, and took over billy in the in the real world in season three so, but now is that is this the the embodiment or the evolution of the thessal hydra or like i'm not even sure if i'm saying that correctly but i don't know i 
I don't know. It's, it's, it's weird. We're gonna have to look forward to. It's it's really it's really interesting seeing a new show do that with like new lore. You know, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to end this reaction right here. But there's so much that could go well for this. These are gonna be longer episodes. It's gonna be a split season. I mean, that's the new thing Netflix is doing. It's fine, but it builds anticipation, and the mm. anti anticipation is ticking right now. And I'm very very excited. I am I'm hyped. I'm I I season three, season two and three, like okay, so season two I was really hyped for. Season three I was less hyped for. I kind of watched that all in one sitting and was kinda okay, I'm not really affected. Uh this the maybe it's the time we waited, but this one I'm really hyped for and I think this show is really gonna come back with a bang. I think it's gonna have more of a horror element too. Yeah. I think it's gonna have more of that. But yeah, uh, we're seeing it before you can like and subscribe. You know, all the usual stuff you do for YouTube videos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so that's about it for uh, this one. And we're going to have a reaction on whenever the Thor trailer drops. Uh, we're still waiting for that one right now. Yeah, that one could be any time. Any time now. It could be later today. We don't know. But we will <laughs> get it to you as soon as we can.